and it's this big kind of grassy hill and people are just kind of recording the show. Everyone's sitting down on the grass. No one's doing it. And it's a music festival. What do you usually do at a music festival? You dance. But everyone is so concerned with what's happening around them and what's happening near you. And out of the blue comes this one like random scrawny dude stands up and just starts dancing. And I'm not talking dancing where you kind of like, you know, roll your hands or, you know, do a little awkward. He's going this 100%. Guy is 100% like through the wall. Like he's putting his heart and soul into it. And of course, for sure, the first minute or two, people are thinking exactly what you said. Is this guy crazy? Is this man taking some kind of narcotics? Is he doing all right? You know, but a minute or two goes by and people are like, no, he's just doing it because he's digging it. He's vibing. A minute or two passes, you know, uh, maybe a girl stands up, comes over with him and starts, you know what? If you're dancing, I'm dancing. All right. And that group mentality that started to bubble up from it, when you see one guy doing it, nobody ever wants to be the first one to do Mm -hmm. it because you seem like the crazy one. But that's how trends start. You Mm got to be a little crazy to get things moving. Right. And so people start rolling. It's that like, you know, it's it's just bubbling up. Right. And so two more people come, four more people come. It's just doubling and doubling until eventually. Exactly. Exponential growth until eventually you become the crazy one for not going over and joining the dance circle. Right. You know, and so if if you really want to get something out there, you want to get out and do something that you've, let's say, always wanted to do, you got to try it because guaranteed nobody, you know, maybe for a minute or two, people are staring going, oh my God, what is he doing? But then after a minute or two, people are Emphasis thinking, Emphasis on maybe. 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 You don't even know. It might not even that. happen. Yep. So true. And, and people will watch this and be like, you know, do I have the, the ability to go up there and do that? If you see two or three more people, go join. You know, it's a, it's a great lesson. To, if you ever see somebody else doing something, maybe go and join them. You know, it's Absolutely. one of those things that that group mentality is what makes things so much better. That's why I love those group settings and things, because the more people that are out there doing things, the better, dude. Absolutely. And just to kind of bring it back to the word crazy, I'd like to hope mm-hmm. that I'm not crazy, but I, I, I would go for Hello? unique. But one thing that I would like to say, you know, I think crazy and the word weird are relative, right? Because let's talk mm-hmm. about this specific example. You know, sure. you know, I think if you looked at like the exact definition, you'd call it weird for that behavior that started it. Mm-hmm. But after a while, once more and more people came, it was weird not to join in because everyone else exactly. was sitting down when everyone came there. And, you know, yeah. this is the chance and ability for people to go out of their shell and start something new and when they start something new you become the guy that everyone talks about like we are right now rather than the person who joined in after so my question to you ladies and gentlemen is who do you want to be the person who joined the guy or girl or whatever they identify as or that person themselves